It's a great question. How has GFMD succeeded in convincing the donors to basically sing from the same hymn sheet, our hymn sheet? You know, the, the messages that many of you have been delivering, they're really, we're hearing that echoed back in a concerted and now formal manner through the OECD. And there's three elements. One is consistent engagement from GFMD with the donors through the MFC, through the GovNet, through the Summit for Democracy. So I know that over the years, you've probably seen GFMD at these big global events, the leadership, the secretariat, it's been worth it. It really has to build those relationships. That's one. Two, expertise, learning, and evidence. I don't think we would have gotten here without the impact uh, project. The donors immediately, as we started doing this work, asked for the, what are the best practices that we need? Where is the evidence for those best practices? You know, SEMA works on a lot of this stuff, but there's too much for one organization to do. And so impact has really filled a huge need in terms of the evidence and learning. And three, and this is where I think GFMD really shines, has been the legitimacy and the convening power. As Tom said, over 200 of GFMD's members have contributed uh, into the consultations that have helped to formulate these. The legitimacy that GFMD brings, the trust that its members has uh, in the, the secretariat to be able to collectively uh, share these concerns and to work with the donors has been absolutely essential.